Good afternoon guys, hope you are well. Today I'm going to show you how you can create exciting brochure for your business. I'm taking a size and the size is 8.5 inch by 11 inch like an A4 size paper. I'll not take any background. I'll take the background at last. Now I'll do the design. I'll change the color and there will be no stroke. After that, I'll take the polygon tool. Hold and press the left key. I'll not lose that. I'll use the down arrow key to make a triangle and you know how to create a triangle. At the beginning, I showed you and I'll press and hold the shift key so that I can get it straight. Well and i'll copy the color i've downloaded a brochure sample brochure from google and you can download it also this is a brochure you can take this types of color but don't create your own color well i'll select that and i drop a tool and i'll take this color i'll order it to 270 degree side and I'll decrease the size of that. Hold and press the Alt key, make one more copy of that. Right click, transform, reflect. Okay, I'll place it here and I'll press Ctrl R to take a ruler and I'll take it in the left side so that I can get a good alignment of that. That's perfect. And I'll delete the ruler. Place it here in the middle. Okay, if you are unable to find the middle, then no problem. Make it as a group. Create a rectangle. Change the color, send it to the barcode by pressing Ctrl plus Cali bracket and press and select all of them and then do the alignment. Now select all of them and take them in the right side a little bit and downside. Click anywhere, select that and delete it. Delete the background and right click, ungroup it. It is in the middle, select that, hold and press the Alt key and make one more copy of that. Uh, okay, or if I take it here, I can't find the intersect on that. Yes, that's perfect, but the gaps are not the same. I'll press the uh, down arrow key two times, three times, four times, five times. Okay. And if I increase the size now, and place it here. Well, if it goes outside, then no problem. I'll take it left side using the arrow key. I'll take a ruler to do the element right click upper right. Okay, it's okay, and I'll increase the size a little bit. Let's take it down. Sometimes it's difficult to. Okay, I'm increasing the size, no problem. To do the alignment first. Okay, now I'll take the rectangle tool and create the rectangle again. Change its color and send it backward. And I'll take the smooth tool, hold and press the Alt Shift key and select this one. That means this one, the bigger one. 
I'll go to Pathfinder and second option divide. Right click, ungroup. Select that and delete it. Select the question and delete it. Yes, okay. I'll select the ruler and delete that. Select the ruler and delete it. Okay, this will be my design. Okay. Now you have to download few images from Pixels or Pixabay, some corporate office image. Now I'll go to the file and place. I'll go to the downloads. I have few images. I'll select that. I'm taking this one. Place it. Well, and I'll press Ctrl and fast curly bracket to send it to the backward. Well, and press the shift key and select this one. Right click, create sleeping mask. Ah, control Z. Yes, that is perfect. And now I'll go to the file and uh, place. I'll place one more image, uh, which is corporate. I will place with this size. I'm taking the left side, control and pascal brackets. We'll enter the shift key, select this one, right click, make clipping mask. Okay, it's perfect. Okay, you can adjust the image by clicking here. Now you can increase and decrease the image. I'm decreasing the size of the image, and from here, also I'm decreasing the size. Yes, that's perfect. And I can decrease from here also. Okay. And I'll select that one. I'll click here. And I will be able to decrease the size. Well, not too much. Because this corner will uh, appear. Okay. Uh, that's perfect. Now. I have to take the text tool and left click here and write down Brusha design. Control E and I'll use the font letter or Monsera. I'll take any and then I'll take the semi bold, decrease the size to it is too much. 50. Uh, 50 is uh, also too much. 40 is 40. That's perfect brochure design. Well, if I take Lato, mm, Lato is good. Lato bold. I'm taking Lato bold. Brochure design. Size is okay, and now I'll select that I over tool and take this color business brochure. Okay, if I take orange, yes, this is perfect business brochure. Well, I'll hold and press the Alt key, make one more copy. Text all. Control A.
press enter control E I'll take the middle element control T size is 40 I'll take 25 and here gaps also I'm keeping it here in the middle and then I'll take a rectangle tool create a rectangle with this size save to the back wall take that over tool, take this color design 2020 I'll select that and select this one this text well uh, alignment will not be good because I have to go to the object expand and okay after that now I can do the alignment it's perfect now the right of a tool and take this black design 2020 well I'll select that one and press the alt key Text tool, Control E, Open it. There is a little bit problem. Okay. If you take a safe zone, then it would be better for you. Control A. Light fifteen. Select both of them and go to the align. I'll take this up. This low one. Uh, decrease the size. Light is from regular is perfect. Company name, company slogan, I'll use the yellow, no, not yellow. Mm, control that I'm taking this color. Well, I select both of them, object, expand, appearance object expand okay well expand all of your text company slogans like that i don't to um turn the color black okay company slogan control zero uh, okay Control T forty and the gaps forty. And now go to the Google and search for dummy text. I'm 
remove some. I'll go to the illustrator and take the text tool. Create a paragraph with the size. Um, the text size uh, should be less, 14 or 12. Control A, Control V, Control A, Control T. Gap should be 12 also. And alignment, uh, no, not this alignment, this paragraph, like this. Okay, now I will make the alignment. It's perfect, I think. And uh, I'll select that. I'm going to press the Alt key, make one more copy of that in the text tool. Control A. About mm. us, Control A. 20. Okay, I'll take the text tool. Control A. Well, Control V. Okay. Yes, perfect. Control A, I'll take the sign. Team, no gaps. Well, there is no gaps. Company description, business name, company slogan, but Okay. So, plus. 
I'll select the text with uh, pressing shift. Where is my text? Object expand. Okay, I'm making the text as a uh, shape. So before final as your design, please uh, make the text as shape. And this one. Okay, control my mouse. And now it's time to take the background. I'll take the background white and control first calibrate bracket hold and press both hold and press both now no need to take that and this is your design okay so go to the file and save us Saving as EPS. It will take time. Okay, now what to do? Go to the file, export, set for web. Save. Well, guys, did you understood? Okay, thank you so much.